We are a generation who loves God. We are a generation who trusts in God. We will always hope in God. Greetings, greetings, greetings in the wonderful, precious, holy name of Jesus, the name above all names, the name that is a strong tower, the righteous run to it, and they are saved. They are healed, they are delivered. Our God is good, our God is gracious, our God is merciful, and He's with us. He's with you, my dear friend, in this season, and He will be with you even in the seasons to come, because He never leaves you, and He will never forsake you. He is with you through it all, and He's a good God. We serve a God who loves us, and His love endures forever, and He loves you. Never allow the lies of the enemy to come in and to deceive you to say that God is not good or God's love will fail. God is good and God's love never fails, it never runs out. But dear friend, today I want to pray for you special deliverance prayers that God will set you free, whatever it might be that might be holding you back. God is going to set you free. We serve a God who is good, a God who is gracious, a God who is merciful, a God who is with us, and He is with us through it all. And He is able to set you free, He is able to deliver you, He is able to take you from glory to a greater glory. Believe and trust in Him, and it shall be well with you. Believe and trust in Him, and God will make a way for you. Believe and trust in Him, and all shall be well with you. Let us begin by welcoming the Holy Spirit and then we'll go into a time of prayer and I trust and I believe God is going to bless you. In saying that, let us begin. Precious Holy Spirit of God, we welcome you. Come Lord Holy Spirit, take over control and help us to pray. Help us to press in and help us to receive from the Father even today. I ask this in Jesus' name. Amen. My dear friend, there is deliverance in Christ to all who believe. And this is one of the things that we receive through grace. There is deliverance. And all we need to do as born again believers is step forward and take hold of it. Take hold of your deliverance. Take hold of your breakthrough. Take hold of your blessing. Take hold of the favor that God has for us in Christ. And God will bless you. Today I want to encourage you to do just that. Take hold of your blessing. In saying that, let us go into a time of prayer. We're going to begin by praising God for a few moments. And as we discern God's presence, then we'll begin to pray. Let us begin. Father, we praise you and we thank you. We thank you for your goodness and your mercy towards our lives, without which we wouldn't be here today. We thank you for making a way where there seems to be no way. We thank you for making a way where there is no way. And we thank you that you never leave us helpless, you never leave us alone. You speak to us and you guide us. You show us the way, you say this is the way, walk in it. And we trust and we hope in you. We believe in you. We believe in your wonder-working power. We believe in your Son Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. And we believe that you are making a way even right now. We give you praise, for you deserve all the glory, all the honor, all the praise. And we lift up your name. Thank you that you hear our prayer. And testimonies have been coming in. Testimonies of miracles, signs and wonders. Because you have been doing great things. And you continue to do them. You are the God who answers prayer. And we have seen your hand at work in the lives of many. And even today you are going to bless and touch my dear friend. Because you are good and your mercy endures forever. We give you praise and we thank you for this. In Jesus' name, amen and amen. My dear friend, I'm going to begin to pray for you. As I begin, I want to encourage you, comment and agree and connect in faith. Believe and receive. Father, I pray for my dear friend who is tuned in today, who is listening to this broadcast. Wherever my dear friend is, I pray for complete cleansing, body, soul and spirit. Wherever my dear friend has gone wrong and moved away from you, we come back to you today. My dear friend, I want to encourage you wherever you are. 
If there is anything that the Holy Spirit is convicting you of that you need to repent of, you can do so right now as I pray for you. Father, I pray as my dear friend comes back to you. Set my dear friend free from all bondage, from all legal rights that the enemy is trying to use as an excuse to come in and cause trouble. I pray that you will deliver my dear friend from any demonic attack or any demonic oppression. Set my dear friend free. Bring deliverance in my dear friend's life. Take my dear friend to a greater level and a greater glory. Touch and bless my dear friend's life and surround my dear friend with your goodness. For you are good and your mercy endures forever. You are gracious, you are compassionate, you are slow to anger and abounding in love. And you are with us through it all. I pray that you will bring deliverance, a mighty deliverance. Break every chain, break every barrier, break every bondage. Break every link that is connecting my dear friend to someone else, whether it's a soul tie or some kind of tie that has come about through some form of interaction. Set my dear friend free from every chain or every connection that is connecting them to bondage and to poverty. Set my dear friend free from every chain that is connecting them to addiction. Set my dear friend free from every chain that is connecting them and opening the door for witchcraft to come in. Set my dear friend free from every limiting factor that has been allowed to come in their life because of certain things they might have done. Because the enemy is an opportunist. He tempts us to open the door so that he can come in and cause havoc. I pray wherever the enemy has come in, drive the enemy out and shut the door. Take control of that house, that when the enemy comes to look, he will find that house occupied. I pray that you will bless my dear friend mightily, and surround my dear friend with your goodness and your mercy. Surround my dear friend with shouts and songs of deliverance. Surround my dear friend with victory and blessing, great blessing, the blessing that makes rich and adds no sorrow. Bless my dear friend going in and coming out. And let my dear friend taste and see of your goodness, even in the land of the living. In the name of Jesus. Amen and amen. My dear friend, may you be set free. May you be delivered. May the grace of God that is sufficient make a way for you. And may he favor you even in this season. In Jesus' mighty name, Amen and Amen. God bless you. Thank you for watching. If you were blessed by this video and you would like to support us to keep making content like this, you can do so via PayPal or Patreon. The links are provided in the description. God bless you and goodbye.